Hello. Hello, Officer Valenti. I would like to make a report that my girlfriend's mother's walker was recently stolen. Your girlfriend's mother's what is missing? Her walker. And it was taken from the very nursing home that she stays at, right here in Cohoes. Look, I'm investigating a murder here. A murder? Somebody cut the baby out of a pregnant woman. I can understand that. But this is a very expensive walker, and I do appreciate if you would just put a little effort into this. What? Like I said, it's a very expensive walker, and my girlfriend is very distraught about it. We're only gonna be in town for a few days, so we need to move this process along as quickly as possible. We can help with the investigation. Look, I really don't care about your mother's walker. Is that clear? We're at the station now. We'll be waiting for you at your office. Goodbye, officer. We're gonna have to take off for a little bit here. Sounds like I've got a couple of cowboys on their way to the station. What do they want? I don't know. Something about some old lady's walker. They can finish up here. Okay. I was the first officer on the scene that day. We need more officers like a him on the force. Uh, there is, you just have to find them. I'm sure you're right. I got that woman first. What I saw that day was so horrible, it turned my stomach. I remember that day very well. I'll never forget what he did to me and my friends that day. It just may be possible this guy took the walker. If it wasn't for that truck driver, I don't know what would have happened. I tried to tell them. They wouldn't listen. Fancy doctors. Fancy lawyers. I tried to tell them. I really did. Bastards. I can't believe they didn't put him on trial. I know what you mean. I think he's got my mother's walker. I think so. And then they just put him in a nursing home. I cut him. Anybody know where she went to get this manicure? Somebody who lives out by the nursing home. One on the hill the there. The same nursing home Leatherface was in? It sure is. Check it out. Detective, you have two people in your office on your computer. In my office? They got here about ten minutes ago. Where do we go from here, Lieutenant? The head and the baby are missing. They have to be somewhere. Do you think we'll get it back? Uh, yes, I do. He's probably at his old house. Jeez. I'll head back to the house. Get that coroner's report. Right away. Find it by tomorrow morning. Just what the hell do you think you two are doing? Oh, boy. We told you we'd meet you back here at your office. We did. I didn't mean you two could come in there and have your way with my computer. I told you I looked into your mother's walker, but that wasn't good enough, was it? No. No? Uh-uh. Her mother is very attached to that walker. Look, I really don't care about your mother's walker. I told you I'm investigating a murder. Now, both of you, out of here. We're obviously not gonna get any help from Officer Valente. So I'll go to Leatherface's house and get your mother's walker back. You and Norman can go together. That's uh, quite all right. I'll uh, go Sit alone. Right back and you'll hear a tale okay, remember, tale it's the road just behind the nursing home. Yes, the one you showed me earlier. Anything else I should know? 
The cleaner said something about a foundation behind the old house. So if I can't find anything at Leatherface's house, you're saying check a behind the house, there's a foundation somewhere, and check there? I think you should. I shouldn't have any problem. Leatherface is a very old man. I will get that walker back. My Aunt Rita's house is just at the corner. I'll be back in less than one hour. It's him.